Yeah, I was in Ohio hunting. My dad had some property and I wanted to go up to the, the tree stand early. So about noon I went up and I'm walking up through the woods and I could see some light through the trees. And I threw my binoculars up and I looked and I was looking like right there. And so I was like, oh, that's a decent buck, you know? And then it was like this genuine double take, like, wait a minute, something's different, you know? And he went running off through the trees and I was like, oh man, because I just had a bow. There's no way I could have got a shot at him. So I got up in the tree and I was there and then probably four hours later, he comes walking through the trees and I can see him like 70, 80 yards down through the trees and he stops and he walks away the same direction he came from. I'm like, ah, oh. and then probably another hour later, it's getting close to dark. Here he comes again on the same path and he gets within about 40 yards of me, but he's behind the trees and I can't get a shot and he walks off. And now I'm depressed, you know, and it's getting dark and dark. And there's a little buck down below me. He has white antlers and I could just barely see his antlers. And so I, I, I got, I was taking my arrow out of my bow and I looked back down and there he stood. And with all the white, I could make him out. And so I put the arrow back in the bow and, and pulled up and, and shot real fast. And I didn't. It did, something sounded weird when the, the arrow hit him, but he jumped and took off and I saw, he ran past this huge old tree that had big, real shaggy white bark on it. So I knew he went right past there. So I just went back to the house and waited like an hour and, and grabbed a Coleman lantern and went back out and went to that tree and, and found a little speck of blood. And he only ran probably 10 more yards after that. But I didn't tell my dad. I told my dad, I was like, I need help going to get this deer I shot. And I didn't tell him what it was. And I had it hanging in a tree. And uh, when we rode up there and dad said, what in the world is that? And I was like, yeah, exactly. So they call it pie ball, but that's my favorite thing that I've ever hunted. I like him too, but <laughs> ain't he cool?